Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Appa in case you guys are new here. I know this seems a little bit weird, but today I wanted to film, but I didn't really want to get all decked up. Like I have makeup and everything on, but I don't really want to do my hair and be on camera today. So I just decided today we're just going to relax and we're going to sit here and do this update video. So this is my Bath and Body Works project use it up like the six month mark. I started this project back in January and now it's August and I need to update you guys on my progress. I will be adding new fall items. I already added some summer items, but I will be adding some fall items to this project as well and then we're gonna do like a final finale at the end of the year so i'm gonna go ahead and get started with the items that i did use up and then the items that i didn't use up which will most likely be going on to my fall edition of this project my name is Appa in case you are new here and i love bath and body works i love anything girly um, whether it's fragrance or makeup and uh, I have a lot of it and I really need to reduce my stash because I am planning on moving from the Cleveland Ohio region okay let's go ahead and get started with all of the hand soaps that I have used up in this project and I've used up a total of eight I believe the first one that I have here is marshmallow flurries really proud that I have used up so many hand soaps the second one is vanilla bean noel used it up completely then i have gingerbread swirl they're all from the same line from the winter collection um as you can tell the packaging is similar and this one is a winter candy apple these were all foaming guys that i used up and then I also have a fresh sparkling snow, my absolute fave, and that's what that looks like. And then I have one from the travel, I think this was the travel line that they came out with. And this is New York City Champagne Toast, looks like that. And then the next two that I have here is also from the same line and it is a lavender marshmallow. I actually used a candle from Aldi which smells a lot like this one. And then I also have key lime biscotti and that's what that one looks like. So all of the hand soaps that I had in this project were used up and I'm really really happy about that. There's still some hand soaps that I'm currently using and I will talk about it once I'm done with all of the products that I completely used up. So moving on to lotions, I have one, two, three, four, five, five lotions in total in the regular size. The first one that I have here is the Victoria's Secret um, under the covers. I did cut this one up and I used it up completely. This was actually part of my 2019 fall project use it up, but I decided to move this on to the winter project use it up for 2020 because it wasn't completely done and I'm so happy that I finally did use this one up back in January. And then I have Winterberry Wonder, used it up. Winter Candy Apple, really proud of that. And then two more, and this is a Snowflakes and Cashmere. I used that one up. And then also a Fresh and Sparkling Snow, looks like that. So really proud of myself overall. I think I did a pretty decent job. Um, moving on to shower gels now, so I have about four, almost five actually, but um, completely used up four. So the first one is uh, Snowflakes and Cashmere. As I try to, in my project, like use up the lotion, the fragrance mist, and the shower gel all together, so I was really happy to do that. 
I like to be all matchy matchy and then I used up amber blush in the shower gel used up winterberry wonder this is the more recent packaging the one in the lotion was a little bit older and then I also have winter candy apples so those were all completely used up in terms of shower gel and now moving on to fragrance mist I used up two of them the first one is snowflakes and cashmere and then the second one is a fresh sparkling snow actually I lied I used up three because I did carry one fragrance mist on from my 2019 project and that is marshmallow pumpkin latte so really really proud of that and I'm so excited to do the fall intro i have some new goodies that i want to introduce to this project so i'm really really like happy overall with my progress okay so moving on to mini lotions that i completely used up the first one that i have here is vanilla bean noel this is also from my 2019 project but i'm happy that i completely used it up and then i also have ginger pear this is not from Bath & Body Works, it is from a brand called Simple Pleasures and it was a one ounce, almost one ounce and um, yeah, completely used it up. Not the biggest fan of this type of body cream um, or this brand in general but I'm just happy that I completely used that one up. Now I'm going to move on to the stuff that I somewhat did make a progress on and then I'm going to talk about some of the summer stuff that were added to this project. So the first two things were actually in my purse or they're currently still in my purse but I've made a significant progress, I just haven't finished them. The first item is this Equate Beauty's Gingerbread Stars Hand Sanitizer. It was actually over here as you can see the mark when I did start this project. So I did use a significant amount. You know, it's almost done. I don't have that much left. And uh, you know, when we're going out and stuff, we're using hand sanitizers a lot. So I'm pretty sure that I will use this up completely probably by the end of August. And then I also have a little bit of the frosted berries from the body shop. This is a mini body cream, which is also something that was in my purse. I don't really have a lot left, guys, and I'm working on it currently. So um, really happy that I made a significant progress. So currently, I'm also still working on my happy vibes which is actually from last summer but I have been using this in my bathroom as a hand lotion so right now I know it's all moved and stuff but right now it's over here and I'm just hoping that by the end of the year I completely just use it up and I should be able to sometimes like I finish the shower gel before I finish the lotion and oftentimes what I do is that I put it right next to the sink right next to a hand soap and that's what I'm using this one for so hoping to make more progress in the future and something I didn't really make a lot of progress in is this frosted snow blossom which is something I had actually introduced in the winter project use it up but um, I just didn't get to it. it I haven't really used that much of it maybe it's like till here so maybe I'll mark that after I'm done with this video but um, this is probably again gonna go on to the fall project again with my body sprays guys I'm not really like too hard on myself if I don't you know use it up completely so significant progress I would say um, not as much as I was hoping for with the winter candy apple body spray I was over here when I started this but um, I just haven't been using it because now it's summertime and I want to use more of my summer and warmer or not warmer but like citrusy scents now so I haven't really been gravitated towards this one as much 
if I don't use this as a body spray, I probably most likely will use this as a room spray in the next couple of weeks. So we'll see where this one will stand in the next couple of days. Another product that I didn't really make a significant progress on just because, you know, my mood kind of changed with the type of product that I wanted to use. And it's this uh, cup of warm fine fragrance mist. Not a lot of progress since my last intro, but I think in the fall time I will be using this quite a lot more so this will be part of my fall project to use it up for this year. And now I'm going to move on to the summer stuff guys that I'm currently using and have made somewhat of a progress and if I have not made a progress I'm going to try to you know push them to the fall. So this one is Lovely Dreamer. I actually have a little bit left. Um, one or two uses maybe one use probably and then this will be done for sure with my fragrance mist for lovely dreamer i have used up a lot of it i really like this scent quite a lot so i'm pretty impressed with the amount that i did use up and will continue to use as much as i can and if i get bored i probably will switch to the fall stuff but um yeah, really enjoy it. This is probably something that I'm not going to use as a room spray. I can definitely tell you that. But really, really like it and I think it's appropriate for any time of the year. So excited that I did use up so much of it. And then for the lotion, I still have quite a decent amount left. But I've made a significant progress considering the fact that I only started using this like maybe the first week of July. I'm really, really impressed. And um, like I said, if I finish the shower gel before I finish the lotion with the hand wash, I probably will use that on my sink. So yeah, really happy that I made a significant progress. And the two hand soaps that I'm currently using right now, which I know I'm going to use up pretty quickly is the blueberry crumble and it's halfway there and then I also have Hawaii coconut colada. I'm not the biggest fan of this scent but I'm just trying to use up because I did buy this with my own money and um, I don't want too many products laying around. So those are two things that I'm currently using and also the lovely dreamer stuff. And then I also have beach nights which i still haven't gotten to yet i probably will continue on this one to the fall edition of this project right now there's product actually it's quite low than the mark line um it's like about here i don't know why i marked it up here but i am excited to keep using this this is one of my favorite lotions from bath and body works like favorite scents from bath and body works of all time and yeah i will continue to use this in the fall i feel like this scent is one of those scents which you can wear any time of the year and it kind of does remind me of fall in a weird way as well so i will continue to keep using this in the fall and then i also have sweet escape i made a significant progress in sweet escape i don't really have that much left uh, when I first started using this, I think it was last summer and it was up till here, but um, when I switched it out, my fragrances, I was pretty low on it, probably around here or something, but I've made a significant progress and I'm really, really happy for that. And then with Beach Nights, um, not a significant progress. I didn't even mark it because I know I haven't like used it at all this year, so that's that. And I think the last product, which was originally part of the winter stuff, and I haven't really used that much of it, but I've made some progress in it, is the Twisted Peppermint. I don't know if you can see, but actually it's at this uh, mark, and I need to just mark these and try to use them either in the fall or winter. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if I want to add this one or switch it out with another scent, but that's the last item, guys. So I hope you liked this video. I hope this was somewhat satisfying for you. I know I love watching these videos. I know you don't see my face, but you see my legs and my 
arms um but uh, thank you so much you guys for watching and i will see you in my next one bye guys